How you going guys? Today I'm going to run through 5 tips on how to increase your SEO for Squarespace websites. Let's jump straight into it and look at tip, tip number 1. Tip number 1 is about the website content and structure. You have to make sure that your website is structured correctly and has the appropriate content so Google, so Google can understand what your website offers and who to show your website to. So what I mean by this is, I'm looking at my website now and we're a digital marketing agency and we structure our website in a way that we try to include information about all of the services that we have on the home page and some reviews. So you can see we give subheadings to our services and then give some more information about our services here. So when Google goes through and analyzes data, they can understand how we're operating and what services we offer and they can get a bit more information about us. In the same way, in our contact section, we offer the contact us information and then we also offer us the about us information so Google can find more information and understand what our brand is about and what our website's about. This makes it super easy for Google to eventually find who we are and what we do. The next tip I want to talk about is producing regular content for your website. And the best place to load this onto is your blog. So my blog's up here in the top right hand corner and you can see that I've got regular posts on here. And this is super, super important because Google wants to see that you're keeping up to date with your website and that you're posting regularly and that you're creating value for people who are using Google. So if you can keep posting on your blog and producing valuable content, then Google's going to reward you by showing you to more people. And this is really, really important to do. So I recommend you try and produce one piece of content on your blog per month because it's a really, really powerful way of getting Google to see that you're a good website. Now this might be the possibly the most important trick for SEO, it's backlinks. So backlinks are essentially when someone links back to your website. So if I linked to say Facebook here, then that would count as a backlink for Facebook. And backlinks essentially show Google that your website's valuable and important because people are linking to it. And you can see your backlinks by going into your Google search console and navigating to links. And then you can have a look at top linking sites. And that just means who's linking to you. You can see I've got 21 external links and then you can see who I've got them from. And this is really powerful information because this shows Google that these websites must link to my website for a reason and that reason must be valuable. Next is page metadata. Page metadata might be the most important part of how to get ranked in Google. Page metadata is what comes up for your page when Google searches it. So let's type in IPM media and have a look at what comes up for my home page. So the metadata is here. I've got my name, IPM Media, and then the slogan, Profitable Digital Marketing. I then got my additional information down here, helping organizations through Profitable Digital Marketing, Adelaide-based digital marketing agency. This just gives Google a bit more information about what I do and who I am. And it's really important to include your keywords in these different areas. You can also see down here, I've got customized information for my digital marketing page, Adelaide. And this really just helps Google understand who you are and what you do. So you really want to focus on choosing keywords in here that reflect your business and what you want to come up for when people are searching you in Google. And last but not least, mobile optimization is key for SEO nowadays. Because most people are using their phones for searching, you have to have a website that's optimized for mobile. And thankfully Squarespace does a really good job of that. And here you go, you can see what my website looks like optimized for mobile down here. So it all works, it's all clickable, big buttons. You can access the home page, you can access the contact us, you can access the menus, you can submit information, you can have a look at the map, and you can see the footer. This is really important because Google does value mobile optimization so much nowadays. 
So if you don't have mobile optimization, you're missing out on a lot of traffic and Google will punish you for that and won't show you as much in their search engines. Hope you guys enjoyed these quick five tips for improving SEO on Squarespace website. Have a great day guys. Bye bye.